It's road, road trip, trip time. time! We're going on our first road trip as a family of four. Oh, yeah, it is. We have our two month old, four year old, a wannabe four year old, <laughs> and me. <laughs> but we have not packed. We leave first thing in the morning. We were supposed to fly out yeah. on Saturday. And Free instead, the cost of tickets, unfortunately. Yeah, we decided let's road trip, let's try this out, we'll fly home. I can't wait for you guys to see where we're going. I mean, nothing like being <laughs> stuck in the car with my wife and kids for three days. <laughs> we're obviously in our parenting era, and thankfully, Walmart is sponsoring this video. Thank you so much because we had so many things that we needed to buy for a road trip that we weren't prepared for when we were flying. Luckily, walmart.com came in clutch because I was able to literally overnight some of the things that we needed. And now we're gonna have Steven unbox it. All right, babe, I need your help. Know what, baby. I need you to um, open up this car seat and wow. some diapers and some- Some wipes? Some wipes. What's this? I got us a baby monitor. Okay, because I figured it'd be easier to just take one with us than to unhook Alea's. Also, Walmart had so many affordable options and this one was, had really high reviews and was super affordable, so. I know, mom's better for me. <laughs> Safety first. Again, Walmart has so many options and they're all super affordable. Love it. Nice, and dual cup holders. Woohoo, Abe's writing in style. Foam, Walmart breaks foam. How <laughs> many of these bad boys you want? Um, three, I think that'll be, no, two, maybe two. I think two's good, I two's know. fine. <laughs> and we need to install this car seat too. How many of these puppies do you want? Do you think one will be fine? One and a half box. Yeah, I think we'll be good with one. If we need more, you can always just order more, remember? Walmart.com. Come like the next day. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Whatever era you're in, you can find it on Walmart.com. You can shop the link in our bio. I'll also put a comment for you guys. But now it is time for us to start packing. Really keep <laughs> <laughs> Dogs are ready to hang at grandma's house for the week. This is how packing's going so far. This is all of Avril's clean laundry. So much fall stuff we're lacking on warm summer stuff. So hopefully we'll have enough outfit. Oh, I hate packing, it's so stressful. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Avril is all packed. If you get like a little kid's travel suitcase on the airplane, this can be their personal item. And I just roll all his main clothes. And then these two, I just laid on top. Socks, shoes, underwear. The hair stuff will eventually have to go in my suitcase on our flight home. But anyways, this will be perfect for his personal item on his flight. And you don't have to pay for his suitcase. A reel's officially packed. Okay, now to go do mine. My toxic trait is not putting laundry away and letting it sit in laundry baskets in my closet. We're gonna dig through those to find some clothes. I'm only two months postpartum, so trying to squeeze into clothes I used to be able to fit into is still a nightmare. That's never fun, but hopefully we'll get some cute options to take. Okay, it's 10.30 in the morning. We were supposed to leave at uh, seven. I didn't even get done packing until one o'clock in the morning. And I'll admit it took way too long, too much longer than I'd like to pick out clothes that I fit into postpartum still. So Stephen is now cutting up all the fruit. Chopping that fruit. Cutting Abe's grapes in quarters. Abriel is sleeping. We all went to bed at two. Okay, so we're gonna hurry up. We're running right pack, on time. Pack the rest of our stuff and then head yeah, out. I'm thinking, like, I, I told Ash this. I said the last thing I wanna do on like like a road trip is like rush. So yeah. we're just gonna take our time, get there safely. No rush, we're good. Okay, we'll see you there in three weeks. Abe wants to take the camper. No. Oh. It's only almost one o'clock. We're supposed to leave at seven. I think we barely missed that deadline. <laughs> we're just pulling out of our driveway. I don't Abriel, think we anything for once. Well, hopefully not. Abriel's in his new car seat, all cozy. Miss Alea's back there, happy as a clam. So uh, let's try this. First stop, we need some lunch. So we've been in the car for like almost four hours. Four, four. And Alea just started crying for the first time, which we're trying to find a place to stop and eat and- Abe's chaos. To, yeah, Abe's sleeping. Go to the bathroom, change diapers, few bottles. So it'll be our first stop. And then I think we'll drive until like what, eight or nine? A.M. We'll yeah. be there. We'll see how far we get today, but luckily we're taking our time. 
stuff today at dinner, and he's gonna show you. And if he gets one wrong, he doesn't get any ice cream. <laughs> All right, what's this? <laughs> Iowa, what's this? California, what's this down here? <laughs> That's the big one. It's where Joy and Nika. And what's this one here? <laughs> where your cousins live? Disney World. No, it's just you know, it's there. It's Florida. What's the whole thing called? United States. Like, very good. Um, since you got this one wrong, you know, guess what? No ice cream. I don't make the rules. I'm sorry. We are on the road again. It's loud in here. It is kind of loud in here. Gabriel, are you having so much fun? <laughs> do you wish you would have flown? Or do you like driving? I mean, we did a lot of road trips, but I also flew in like second grade, but we went overseas a lot to visit family, so anyways. Another long, boring drive for a few hours, and then we're in Missouri right now, right? Misery. Misery. All right, okay. can you guess where we're going? Gabriel doesn't believe me that it's 10 p.m. It is. <laughs> we're a different time zone. No, yeah. is it not? <laughs> you want to stay at the hotel? We got we got you a babysitter. Mom and Dad are going to run over and um, to this place, Dave and & Buster's. And you can stay here, though, okay? No, I want to go there. No, no, you said you want to stay at the hotel. Yeah, I want to. Are you sure? Yeah. All right. Well, okay. Get it, babe. Are you able to uh, keep an eye on the kids? I'm going to go play some video games, okay? I'll be back. See ya. almost one o'clock in the morning and it's time to go night night and i forgot all of my toiletries at home and a clean shirt that's stain oh <laughs> all right night night sleep tight See you in the a.m <laughs> good morning good morning good morning <laughs> it is day two of our three-day road trip Good job, it will be day three. And what are the essentials for a road trip, Abe? iPad and snack. Fruit, crackers, chips, candy, beef jerky, Steven did it all. No, I was gonna say you said I packed. I'm snacks. like, when did you pack that? Because I packed because we packed I yellow. packed all the clothes. Anyways, <laughs> Steven forgot all of his toiletries at home. Brushing my teeth with Okay, I forgot my toothpaste too, to so I had to use the strawberry toothpaste. It's not good. Anyways, we're in the car. We're ready for day two. Should we give you a hint? Let's see if you know where we're going. Right now, we're in Wichita. I went to college in uh, Dodge City. So, we're going to see Papa Matt. We're in Wichita. <laughs> Cousin Aiden, that might have just given the whole trip away. But we are in Wichita, Kansas. You know, you know. <laughs> Set our prayers. We did. Safe car, safe traffic around us. Is that safe? That's right. Well, right. hit the road. What do you see? see? Snow. You see mountains and snow? I see a train in cornfields. <laughs> no, I see that mountain. Oh, that's a, that is a mountain of dirt. The snow next to it. I think that's uh, a building or salt. <laughs> It's snow. it's snow. We just stopped to go to the bathroom and give sis a bottle and change diapers. And we stopped for dinner. 
Ready for bed. Sis is ready for bed. Me too. Hey, we can just drive uh, and stay in Las Vegas tonight if you want to. Why are you driving to Las Vegas? It's Vegas, baby. Vegas is <laughs> Vegas. <laughs> hey, girl, how you doing back there? Mexico. What are we gonna do tonight, babe? He's wrestling himself. And she was crying, so we didn't get as far as we'd like to, but there's always tomorrow. And uh, the winter oh. weather advisory is supposed to be done at 6 a.m., so we're hoping that just sleeping here and then maybe leaving a little early will be better than driving in the dark into the unknown, so. Anyways, we are going to head down to the swimming pool. Day three in the car with my amazing wife and beautiful kids. So we're gonna drive safely today. We had to stop early, an hour early last night because of snow. And there's still snow outside. So. Still snow but outside. Everyone we ran into at breakfast this morning said this roads are clear now, so. Did you remember to bring it today? What? A good attitude? No, I'm saying yesterday you forgot it. No, it was just last night when I was trying to sleep. All right, let's do this. <laughs> it is pretty though, look how nice it is. Walking back, I'm super curious to hear the situation. Tell me, tell me. Oh, that's what happened in the semi. The tire caught it, oh. called that one, and then so it, it caught it. And they try to, so it pulls you down. So you try to correct it, and then it jack, it uh, literally turned it all the way to the side. So there's a tow truck up there that's back in and out, back forward, back forward. They almost got it, but the other people have been here for a while, so we kind of got here just in time, I guess. Dang. Hopefully, we won't lose that much time. But they're glad back that the they're road. safe, though. Holy cow. Yeah. Everyone's getting back in their cars and the semi is back on the road. Everyone's safe. Thank you, Jesus. Let's do it. Another car in the ditch that they're trying to shovel out. Oh no, they have a tow truck right there. Is that what they're doing? It's a rescue truck. Uh, okay, we gotta be real careful. <sighs> yeah, holy cow. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm terrified. <gasps> oh my gosh, see like that. Holy cow. We're out of the snow, but that was kind of scary in Terrifying. many places. At one point, the car came by, Ash was looking down. The car goes to pass us to go in that way. Slush, it goes bam, slush went all over our windshield. And we couldn't the see, couldn't and there was a ton of cars around us. Oh my gosh, I about had a heart attack. Now it's raining, but we did get lunch real quick. We only have two more hours, two more hours. Woohoo! Well, the views over there, that was pretty. The view over here is pretty as well. No. <laughs> All right. 
We made it here all the way down to where? Where are we? What state are we in? To... I'm just gonna say it because people. Oh, there it is. Okay, Arizona, and Miss Ma'am is mad. Very mad. And can I just say something? That took way longer than flying. That was a little ridiculous. No, -uh. our flight didn't even, doesn't even leave for a few hours. That's so true. We made so it's it. actually faster. Um, Ariel, <laughs> what do you think about driving? Do you think it was a good idea or bad? A good idea. A good idea. You so do it again? you want to drive it again sometime? Yeah. I want to go back. You want to go back? Can you tell everyone thanks for coming on a trip with us? So now we gotta we gotta go get ready for a surprise party. And you're gonna go rest. <laughs> See you later. Bye. Bye.